Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Four trade targets for the four-time Pro Bowl running back. Minnesota Vikings running back Dalvin Cook is reportedly at nearly 100% which means a team could trade for him in the coming days. The four-time pro bowler has reportedly been on the block for quite some time, and now that it is he is healthy, there is nothing stopping other teams from acquiring the former second-round pick. After Dalvin started and appeared in all 17 games last year, Cook underwent surgery to repair a nagging shoulder injury that had plagued him since the season 2019. Plague.The operation reportedly went according to plan, meaning the 28-year-old should be in the shape of his life by 2023. So why should the Vikings trade Dalvin Cook? The answer to this question boils down to money. Cook did currently has a cap hit of $14.1 million this year, which is remarkably high for a running back. Oh, of course, it takes two to tango, which means the Vikings need to find a suitor. Luckily, that shouldn't be too difficult. Dalvin Cook is still one of the best running backs in the league and any team trading for him would only be responsible for a portion of his cap hit. He would make all the sense in the world for a competitor, but which teams are most likely to make a move? The most obvious fit here is the Kansas City Chiefs. Led by elite duo Patrick Mahomes and Andy Reid, the Chiefs have the best offense in football but they could certainly use more running back help. The Clyde Edwards-Hilaire experience is officially over and Isaiah Pacheco is better off as a rotation defender. Damian Harris is a solid early threat and James Cook has potential as a pace changer, but they don't hold a candle to Dalvin Cook. The Bills need a physical back that can punish defenders in cold weather games and nobody fits that bill better than Cook. Of course, the Bills are NT the only AFC East team that could try to trade for Dalvin Cook. The Miami Dolphins have signed Raheem Mostard and Jeff Wilson to free agency, but neither player is more than a stopgap at this point in their 